Hello everybody, it is December 13th and today for this particular episode uh, I'm going to attempt this greed challenge. Um, the daily challenge, uh, you're only ranked based on um, the total score that you have. Uh, so there is no... You, you basically do everything you can uh, to maximize your score. So that's what we shall try to do. Um, I'm gonna try to pull out all the stops that I can uh, muster um, and see about what I can put together. Uh, of course, um, these are difficult in the sense that it is just an exercise in greed. Um, and I've already lost some money up there, so which is too bad. And, of course, trying to stay alive. I mean, that is always the important task. But, um, often, when I'm trying the daily challenge, um, I do prioritize money over my own life. Um, so, we'll see how it goes. There's really not much to do in this first one, so let's just get going. Um, that was very little money for the first level, and we'll just move on. Um, so basically, if I see gems, and that was stupid, and that was even more stupid, and I probably should have... Okay, um, I'm not sure what I'm doing anymore. Uh, my friend told me I had to play this daily challenge, so here I am, and uh, I'm not sure if that was the right decision. I don't really want to break pots on any creatures. Okay, I oh, should have done that down lower. I can get down there. Okay. Alright. Uh. <laughs> uh. I am so nervous and all I'm doing is just trying to um, stay alive long enough to be able to uh, do a little bit of ghosting. I didn't see the damsel on this level. She's probably up higher in one of those blocked off areas. I didn't even see the shopkeeper. Did I just miss it completely or is there no shopkeeper in this level? Alright. Let's draw the ghost. Uh, so if we start the ghost over... On this side, we can just trail run after, but how do I ghost this gem down here? Uh, it's probably going to be a little tricky. Maybe... Oh, too late. I don't have enough time to go down there, I think. Mm, maybe I should have done that one first. Um, that's alright. Uh, this is... I'm not doing too well. I have two health and doing my best to see what I can do in terms of maximizing my score, like I said before. Um, and who knows, maybe this daily challenge will end in a disaster really early on and then I'll end up trying to do some speedruns uh, <clears throat> after the run ends, but I shouldn't be trying to uh, jinx myself too hard. Okay, so... Well, the ghost is not... It's just gonna follow me up. So, I guess I'll... 
uh, let's see if I can predictably get the ghost to come down far enough. Yeah, okay, good. Ah, oh, well. There's enough space for me to run under the ghost there. Um, got some money here. And we'll draw the ghost up here. And we'll run under him again. Her, sorry. The ghost's girl. Um, and we'll get out of here. Oh, so much work for just a wee tiny bit of money. Um, normally, even if I'm not ghosting at the end of uh, two levels... What? Uh oh. Yeah, usually at the end of two levels, I already have this much money. Um, or more often. And instead, I have to ghost three gems and end up with a little tiny amount of money. I didn't see the damsel or the shop in that level. Oh my gosh. Okay. What am I doing? Should I. Uh, definitely leave that alone for now. Um, there is that spider. Uh, let, hopefully, well, that didn't work out too badly. Okay, those are all triggered. Uh, this is just not a friendly. Just not a friendly, um, spelunky level. Should I use a rope? Oh, we'll use a rope. I hope I am doing this appropriately and I'm not wasting too much of my resources. Okay. Let's get this down there. Oh, there is a vault. Oh, there is a vault, which means I'm probably going to die real soon. Um, oh, I can't even see what's underneath there. a lot of time too. Well, let's start by ghosting these guys, I guess, and make do with whatever um, comes my way. We'll start the ghost over here. And then, I, I guess if I were to really try to maximize my money output, um, I have to go after the vault. I'm not usually going after the vault unless I have a bunch of bombs um, and a lot of uh, and a shotgun. Really, um, I, I'm I'm not good at dealing with shopkeepers that are aggravated at baseline. They just um, are not fun to deal with. Well, sorry for the slow pace run here. Uh, I don't know why I jumped around there. Hopefully I didn't uh, jump too far and make the... Um, Alright, those gems are ghosted. Was there any over here? No. Okay. I'll just wait for the ghost to sort of come over here so I can have a nice clear path down over, collect those gems, and not have to worry about 
um, the ghost chase thing after me immediately on my tail. I already triggered that arrow trap. Yes, yes. Okay. Let's wait for the ghost to come over here. Ooh, that was really close. That was too close to comfort, really. Uh, get the ghost down here. I'll jump over her head. Ooh, another close. Uh, I, I'm, I'm not really sure. Uh, oh boy. I can't believe that just happened. Uh, that was <laughs> kind of silly. Uh, no wonder my friend told me to try it because it is such a silly, silly daily challenge. I didn't even have a chance to go after the vault. I died from a fall. Um, alrighty. Um, I'm going to uh, try a couple of um, speed runs. And let's see how that goes. So speed running. Um, the goal is to finish the game in um, finish the game in uh, eight minutes or under. Of course, I've never been able to do it. Um, I've spent way too much time. But let's see if I can. So speed running, you're not caring about money, gems, anything. Oh, you're just doing your best to get to the exit and leave as soon as possible. Under 20 seconds, um, you're guaranteed not to have a dark level in the next uh, level, so um, you don't have to worry about that. And the only things I'm going after are basically... Oh, there's a shop. Well, can't do much. And if there is a damsel, pick up the damsel. And I almost lost a health there. If there had been anybody um, down there, that was a lot of time wasted on that run, that level, um, because I got a crate, I got a damsel. And I'm just not gonna take the risk. Wrong side, wrong side, wrong side. Ah, uh, sticky stuff. That's just too much time wasted, I think. And too much health wasted. Okay. Just in case I have a use for sticky bombs. Um, always have a use for sticky bombs anyway. Okay, I'll buy the that. Just in case I make it to the ice caves. But I don't even think... I, I mean, I, I'm already not running this very fast. And so the speedrun achievement is probably not... Okay, well, there's a good item to have for speedruns. Um, because it tells you where the exit is. Uh, it took me two minutes to get past the, um, mines. <laughs> that is not speedy at all and I died because I was trying to grab the damsel to get a health uh, that was silly so let's try that again okay oh my gosh I, I can't read these levels They just, there are some clues that tell you where to go or how to go about it. I'm just not good at figuring it out. 
that was real smart and a uh, I, I, I think alright well at least I whipped an arrow just as how you know I, 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 I don't know I, <laughs> uh, oh uh, well that's the end of that run um, let's let's try one more um, because it's embarrassing. I want to get somewhere. I want to get somewhere where everybody has a name. Um, but anyway. I'm not going to go after the sticky stuff. I can't believe I got hit there. And I can't believe I didn't get hit there. But it's Splunky. Things happen in Splunky in mysterious ways, um, such as loss of time for no good reason. Oh my gosh, okay. Um, I am just not having the greatest luck either. Because I'm I'm hitting some keys on my controller and like, I was trying to do a whipping action, and I just didn't do it. <laughs> and there's nothing I can do about it. Again! Oh, maybe? Okay. Um, one more attempt. Uh, just because it's so quick. Um, and so quick to die. One try on speedrun, I don't even know what to say, I'm just so focused. But at the same time, I'm aware of the fact that I'm trying to say something. Forget about the sticky stuff, keep on running. Get one damsel just so that... I have a slight increased chance of survival just because I know for a fact that it's the thing that's going to kill me. I... why... Uh, Alright, one more damsel. And a crate. And get out. Get out. Get out. I almost died there because... I risked a stupid free fall. Okay, well, not bad, um, just not good either. And of course, I end up with a dark level. This is where I'm inevitably going to die because it is a dark level. lucky um so i got bit by the snake so i had these invisibility frames um and i got hit by the arrow trap that was supposed to take away two health but instead it took away only one um so that was incredibly lucky uh i think when it comes to a speed run Oh man, <laughs> I'm still alive, how? Uh, I have gotten the luckiest, um, I've got the luckiest breaks in terms of um, getting invincibility frames twice in the same run. Um, that, those arrow traps, or not arrow traps, those uh, tiki traps uh, cause four damage. And there is no way on earth I would have survived. Uh, well, I guess. I'm gonna die right here. I can't believe I'm still alive. You know what? I did die right here. Okay. Um. Ah. Uh, 
I guess that will be it for this episode. Um, not a lot of skill in any aspect whatsoever. A few attempted speedruns that fell fell significantly short. Um, I I really don't know how to do speedruns very well. Um, it's just really difficult for me. Um, I had a friend show me how to do it. Um, it took him a few minutes to get through the whole game, and for me, a few minutes means a few deaths. Um, I usually do do a little bit better uh, trying these speedruns by myself without trying to record. Um, I think it's just really distracting, and I'm not used to doing this, but hopefully I'll get better with time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.